Today is the full moon and don't tell me that that's not having an effect on your body. Have you been feeling more tired or anxious for the past day? Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Here are three meditation techniques that I'm recommending and using myself over the next week to help balance this energy, harness its power, and channel or transmute it towards creativity. First is Shakti Mudra or the gesture of power. This is one of the few mudras that is actually best used before bed right at night. This is going to help with insomnia, help improve your sleep quality, and help you feel more rested. This is also one of the few mudras that you shouldn't use for too long. Long, otherwise it will make you tired. The ideal length of time is actually only 5 to 20 minutes. This is a very powerful gesture. That's why it's called the gesture of power. So try it for yourself tonight and see how you feel. The next technique is to use Usha's Mudra or the gesture of dawn first thing in the morning when you wake up. This gesture will also help you balance the energy of the moon but it will also help you keep more active throughout the day. This is really good for that full moon time when you're feeling so tired you can't move. This will help you move at least a little bit. I also use this gesture every month to balance my hormones. Again, a very powerful gesture. Finally, the most powerful one, Kali Mudra, or the gesture of empowerment or the gesture of hidden power. This one is not really for beginners, but you can try it and see how it affects your body. This is similar to the first gesture in that it shouldn't be used for too long and you might need extra rest while using this gesture. The main difference is the first gesture is used more for balancing and this gesture can be used more for transmuting negative emotions. And since I don't have a tutorial up for this one, I'll give it to you right now. As always, follow the beginning steps to enter into that meditative state and when you're ready and you feel the energy in your hands, you can bring them up into Anjali Mudra or the prayer gesture in front of your chest. Slowly cross your right hand over your left, keeping the index fingers pointed up. Don't press them too hard together and the rest of the fingers are interlocked. You will hold this around chest level, a little lower or higher spine, just a few inches away from the body. You can focus your attention towards the energy of the gesture and try to keep your breathing at a one to two ratio, meaning if you take an inhale for five, try to exhale for 10. Make sure you read the caption for more instructions. I would love to create a free five minute guided meditation for one of these gestures so vote in the comments and let me know which one you want to see i'm mal if this was helpful please let me know in the comments share this with someone that needs it and follow along to learn more meditative practices that will actually help you in your life